Film and Sports Talk Worldwide with some news from the world of boxing. So y'all know what time it is. You ain't in a rush to get concussed. Well, guys, let's talk a little bit of Canelo Alvarez. The face of boxing, you know, one of the main mans in the middleweight division. Trying to have that fight with Gennady Golovkin in September. He's on a suspension, a doping suspension right now for being caught twice with Klimbuterol in the system. Uh, we know he says it's the tainted meat. Uh, you know, he's had a hair follicle test. He's passed that. Uh, but we were taking issue with the fact that he didn't uh, join the WBC uh, clean boxing program. All right. So what does he do? He comes out and he joins the VADA uh, testing program. And that's year round. So that's pretty good look. Finally, a pretty good look because it's year-round testing and it's trying to make sure that people understand that he's clean. Uh, at least this, right? Uh, this is not something that we're going to pat him on the back for. This is something that he should do after being caught twice and his big fight on Cinco de Mayo being called off. This is a, a look that uh, something he should have done. So, you know, we won't get props for it, but at least he's done it. Um, you know, now let's hope, now this is me personally, like I've told you guys before, I know that Canelo and Gennady Golovkin are trying to fight at all costs. And the reason being because of the people that they would have to fight if they didn't fight each other. I'm not going to get into it again. So this is decent news. You know, I would like to see that the fight with Golovkin doesn't happen. And both of them fight one of those four people that are out there. We'll name them one more time. If it's Darren Chinko, if it's uh, Jam uh, Jamal Charlo, if it's Danny Jacobs. Demetrius Andre, and here's the fifth one, or Billy Joe Saunders. Either one of these guys should fight them. If they come through those fights, then they should fight each other. And I'm talking Canelo versus Gennady Golovkin. If not, that fight should not be considered big. That's my point. But congratulations, Canelo, for being in the clean boxing program, uh, because that at least gets that shadow off of you. Film Sports Talk, worldwide. And I'm up out of here, y'all.